start with, looks like we have one person currently playing the map. At least that's assuming what it is. That's what I am assuming it is. Uh, I am looking forward to the weekend. I don't know about everyone else. And uh, so let's go ahead and get in and see what we got. Okay, uh, we have motion sensor. That's an easy. We have four infestation types, which is always awesome. A really thin room to begin with. And, oh, 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 we have remote power and a cannon. So this is going to be a little interesting. Um, this is... Oh, wow. Okay. Um, you know what? I'm not going to do that yet. Ah. Okay. Um, this is... I don't know. This is just new to me for some reason, and I'm having, having problems planning, which is never a good thing in this game. So, this is the new patch. We now have ships, and I have a remote power and cannon. Uh, the cannon is really not a good option for most cases, simply because you end up... You're basically going to destroy whatever room you, you attack. And it's just like getting hit with an asteroid. It could do a lot worse. Um, so, it's not an ideal situation in any way, shape, or form. I'm, honestly, right now my major concern is... I'm not ending, I'm not exiting yet, but I do want to... I do want to use that remote power. Uh, it's it simply saves me from having too many ships on at once. And oh Christ, this is a huge ship. Um, I don't think I've seen these. I don't think I've seen anything this big in a long time. I'm really going to, given the size and given that I know there's four infestation types, I'm gonna go ahead and put my motion on drone one because I don't have to worry about how many times I'm using it not yet at least and I'm trying to get through here quickly um, so speaking of the patch uh, all the ships should be the same now which is nice and that means oh actually I'm gonna want to stop this that means uh, any other videos that you watch, if you try it yourself, you shouldn't. Uh, the same amount of scrap, the same chances at everything. The positioning, from my understanding, could very well be different. But, uh, that's, that's circumstantial. That's D50. Okay. I want to get in and get out as quickly as I can. I'm not going to be able to power D-51, but I might be able to do something else. Because I don't... I don't want them to destroy a drawer... Oh, actually, I'm not going to be able to do that. Um, I don't want them to destroy a door too soon. I have to destroy something before I have a chance to explore further. If they break into that room, then there's nothing I can do. But, at least that's a thing. Okay, so see, this is a slightly bad situation. Okay, good news is... They stopped attack at D1. 
Um, the next thing I want to do is D33 and D81. Now, with slime on this ship, I definitely want to be careful. I don't want to spend any longer than I need to doing all this. Um, using mo is a bad thing because that means I have a drone on standstill. And it, it puts me in a bad situation in a lot of ways. But, you know, I so far I feel I've been doing pretty well. Um, going back a point, I don't know that I finished my thought. The cannon is a bad thing because it strikes just like an asteroid. It can force open doors, which means you've already ruined one room. You're, you're not going to get into that room. It's going to hit right. If it forces open a door, that's two rooms, or three, or four. You could cut off a large section of a ship by a, a, using a cannon. Um, <clears throat> it is definitely a desperation style move. On the one hand, I'm thinking this is probably clear. On the other, I'm worried about the time. And both of these should be clear, uh, given the amount of time that I waited. Area, there are a lot of defenses, and nothing else has been hit. Nothing else was actually in a room with defense. So, you know, that's really kind of bad because there's a lot of defenses, and nothing has nothing has shown itself. Um, <clears throat> Thirty-two should be safe. I apologize for the throat clearing. I will work on getting a better mic that actually lets me mute. I know that's general form. The other nice advantage of this patch is it's modified uh, the motion sensor behavior so that no more than 50% of a ship is going to be uh, inconclusive. So... You know, I don't want to say that makes things a lot easier, but it makes things a lot easier. Because under normal motion sensor stances, I get the feeling this would have been just a loss. Um, <clears throat> let's see, I don't know that 11 is safe, do I? So let's close 32, oh, 70. 70 doors on this ship. And this is military B. I didn't know B-class ships could get this big. Because I already see 20 rooms. I'm going to give R9 a little bit more time. My main concern right now is losing a room to... losing a room to slime. Um, especially room 2 or room 14, which are currently the only airlocks I have. Room 20 is the edge of the ship, so this ship is actually bigger. And, okay, I'm going to take a chance that D79 is clear. If this doesn't pan out, I am going to be in... A real bad shape. Um, and if I take one of those risks, then and it doesn't pan out, then yeah, I'm going to be in real bad shape. Currently, haven't seen the slime. Haven't seen anything coming out of room 11, so I'm hoping room 11 is safe. Given the number of, of turrets, I'm thinking I've probably got a pretty good shot with that in most of these rooms, but man, it could go bad real fast, real easy. Okay, so there's an excellent example of 
of something. Um, what you really want to do in these situations is try to be fast about things. If there are two rooms at once, then that's awesome. If I can, if I can verify two rooms at once, that's awesome. Rather, um, actually, I don't know that I want to go through door twenty-four right now because I can't verify what is in on the other side. I don't know that a door isn't already open because if one is, that would be terrible. I'm going to give it another few seconds, and I'm going to go into R12. R12 hasn't gone through D26 yet, so I'm thinking it should be safe. If it's ever not safe again, I'm completely SOL already. There's nothing I can do about it. So, I've delayed long enough. There's another turret in here, so again, this room is clear. <clears throat> I definitely feel... I, I haven't used motion a lot in a long time. This is actually a bad move for me. Um, I'm going to open D25, I'm going to open D68. And instead of doing what I was planning to do... Oh, there's slime in this room now. And I need to get out quickly. Um, D25. Okay. The upshot is it's in a room with a turret. So I can come over here. D14. Oh, damn it. Um, okay, here's my problem right now. Is I just heard a hole breach in R8. Okay. Could have been a lot worse. It's not near here. Are you kidding me? Okay. Room, whatever that was, is no longer safe. Um, I'm going to do something real stupid. I'm going to check this room. Okay. That's good for me because now I don't have to worry about. Okay. Um, <clears throat> now, what I want to do. D60. Get it out of that room. And when I do that. Now I can go into that room. And, okay, door 60 is being attacked. Now what I want to do, before you have a chance to switch back, I hope that is still clear. It's not. Um, nearest one is way down here. Okay, 78. D80. Okay, that room is now clear. Both of those rooms are clear. Number one thing you want to do whenever you do hear that whole breach sound, it's it sounds like metal stretching and, and, and ripping, uh, is close all your doors. Close every door you can, because something's going to break. And you definitely want to avoid that. Um, I know room 12 is clear. I just killed everything in it. And there's Swarm right there. So, okay, rooms that I don't even know about yet. Um, I expect, I expected exactly that. Um, okay, just thinking. So, wow, I'm actually going to run out of motion sensors on this, this run, I bet. 
<clears throat> which is really unusual to see. I'm going to... I'm going to go down to R10, which I believe is clear. It has a turret, so it definitely should be. And... I can detect from R10, but... It's D24, D23, D60, close up behind me. <clears throat> and I just want to make sure... Unfortunately, that's my only next move right now. I can't detect... I can detect into R18. I can open D15. For slime. Okay. So... I want to do the same thing that I did before. So that verifies D18 should be clear now. I'll go ahead and do that real quick, just to make sure nothing else gets in there. And then I'm going to go across to D31, and then down to R4, so I can kill everything. <clears throat> Now, there is everything on this ship. There's swarms, there's leapers, there's cinch, and there are, is slime, as is painfully obvious. And so far, all we've seen is... Okay, I'm going to assume that's clear. I'm going to give it some time and try to avoid that slime. Don't like that stuff. Come back down here. Okay, I definitely want to check out what that is, because if it was a sentry, then I can get more scrap. This is going to end up being a long video, and, and I like that. I've done short videos lately. It was indeed a sentry, with three scrap. That is awesome. I'm going to go ahead and come through here. Stupidly doing that last, and there is slime in this room. And I don't see much else, so I don't care. Oh wait, no. I do care. Uh, lots of rooms that I don't know, so... It doesn't really help me. So... Trying to think what my next. Haven't seen anything come through D24 yet, so I, I'm going to take a chance. I'm gonna take a chance that might be real good. And this is not a powered room. I haven't found the other generator, which is really a bad thing. Um, I'm going to go down. Where I'm going to go down. There's a lot that I just cannot do. With the sensors I have available to me. Okay, what's across D75 and what's on the other side of it are clear. To the best of my reckoning. So, I can go in there and push a little bit further. I can't go in there and push a little bit further. Uh, but what is on the other side of there is clear. Gonna be a thing that got killed. And a big room with a generator. So I can again push a little further. <sighs> really getting nervous at this point. This is a huge ship and I am not equipped. Okay, I found another airlock. Very good. Uh, the room with a turret found. Uh oh. I may have. Okay, did not lock, lock up. Um, 
So, I, I don't know, something about this ship is really getting me worried right now. I think it's just the sheer asteroids coming in that I haven't... Oh, crap. Um, I can't see what those asteroids are doing. Either they missed, or they haven't hit yet. And if they're going to hit, they're going to hit a part that I haven't opened up yet. So that's bad. Uh, currently, I do not have any clear rooms, but what I can do is come down here. That is clear, at least for motion. It could have slime in it. did not have stuff in it, but I can open D4. Okay, I've got a minute, rooms 36 and 35. So I want to explore those as quickly as possible, especially because they could have stuff in it. Okay, so this room was motion clear. This and has all the stuff. So this is where you well, this is where you get no fuel. So what I want to do is I've got a minute right now, not very long. Uh, I want to try to explore every side point that I can. Okay, don't definitely want to avoid that room. Okay, I took too long. Good news is, it stayed contained to that room. Destroyed a couple of doors that I don't need. More. So I can keep going. A little bit. I, I think I'm not going to push this any further than necessary. Um, I've got a lot of scrap right now, and it's all one drone, and I don't have any way to bank that. And... Wow. Something is... Okay, it's, it's working normally now. Um, I can't really explore 29 or 30 safely. Well, I can, actually. So, I'm hoping nothing... Okay. Alright, so I'm going to D51. I would love to get this thing completely explored. But, you know, the amount of time involved, I'm going to try to cut it short before I finish, probably. Uh, but... Boy, it's been an excellent trip. And I don't see the the problem is I don't know where that came from, so I want to do this again. And I just want to watch E61. About one. So I'm going to give this a little bit. I'm real anxious about slime. It's been a long time. I haven't checked those lower rooms. And I want to make sure that I'll be able to get my drone that has all of the resources on it back out. Uh, I am down low on motion, and that's never a good thing. I'm going to give it a few more seconds, and then I'm going to go ahead and push through and assume that both of those rooms are clear. The amount of time a, a leaper got through, even if it was coming from R29, uh, I feel very confident that anything else would be clear. And again, if if I make, make a bad move at this point, I'm going to lose everything. I'm going to lose all the scrap that I've gathered, and we definitely don't want that to happen. So, okay. I would, I would kill for a probe at this point. I would kill for just about anything other than starting equipment. 
Okay. Um, actually, that's really good. Because I can come in here. And, and open that. And I'm just waiting for it to get through. Now, nothing that mo the, the the slime does not trigger motion sensors. Uh, it doesn't move. I mean, it, it grows, but it doesn't move. So, the only thing... There we go. Killed one enemy. Please be a turret. Please be... Nope, it's another jumper. But, that means D6 is clear. Um, um, the disadvantage to what I hear is I'm going to waste... Ooh, drone. Okay. If you have a probe, you have a mine. So that's useless, but it's still in its good points. As long as I don't have slime here now. Okay, so... <laughs> I'm just going to nav it there directly. So I get a drone. Um, wow. First day that this is available, and it's a huge ship, people are getting massive scores. And that's just awesome on so many levels. Uh, there are actually not going to be that many rooms not surveyed. Yeah, fine. Um... And I'm actually should be able to get through this. I accept that. Um. Okay. I'm like I said. I've been spinning here so long. that I am getting, I'm actually getting very concerned about slime just popping up wherever the hell it wants, and that's a bad thing. What I'm going to do is try to bait out 26, try to bait out 32, and if nothing happens after a while, then nothing happens after a while. Uh, worst case scenario, I can vent this room relatively safely. There's a lot of ways into it, so it's unlikely that a door that is absolutely necessary will break. And let me close that and see if I can sneak something into 28. And just just because of the size of the ship, getting around hasn't been that difficult, even though the lower section is a lot of rooms, or a lot of thin rooms. And wow, strategies. I don't really have that much else to say. I should not have done that. That was a terrible move because it just wasted my motion tracker. But that really leads me to believe that everything is clear here. Maybe I shouldn't be exploring with this one. Maybe I should be exploring with another one. That actually would be the really wise thing to do. Okay, I know I can't go into R19. I don't know what's in D31. Uh, you know, there's a good odds that... I'm going to do this. Ho oh, ho! Always be careful with your typing, folks. Always be careful with your typing. Okay, now I know that both those rooms are clear. Which is exactly why I did that. Because I have a motion sensor to verify this is... And I have killed everything in this room. It was a dog! Or maybe. A dog dropped scrap, apparently. Um, oh, another drone. Excellent. Now, here's, here's why I say it's a dog. I've, I've encountered many dogs in my campaign playthrough. And... 
I've, I've never recovered one because, well, reasons. R27. 27 rooms on this thing. I do not believe I've ever seen anything that large. Of course you went the wrong way around the damn drone. I've never actually seen anything that large. 27 rooms. Well, 30, 38 rooms. I've never had anything that big. And if they've changed how things generate so that gen rooms can generate that large, then that's amazing. Um, I do also want to swap with this to see if it has it has a pride. So it doesn't matter. Um, so I'm done in this room. Anyway, I was saying I believe that's a dog because that's the only thing that I've ever seen make that pattern. It's purple goo. Everything else, the, the, the jumpers leave this crystalline. I am lagging for some reason, and I do not like it. I'm lagging enough that it actually canceled navigation. Um, I've seen the jumpers leave a crystalline structure. The... Crap, I don't have any way to... I know this room is full, but I just wanted to see... Uh, the crystalline structure, the sentries, even even the sentries leave, and did that again. I only have four motion trackers left, um, so not much that I can do really. The number of uh, turrets on this ship lead me to believe that I'm actually, let's see, one, two, three, four, Five and activating turrets. I can't see. Is at least five. It might be six. So, so I don't think I'm going to search a room. Um, unfortunately, I didn't find probe. Probing this would be wow. Would take so long. Um, did I see that fifteen is not safe? I know, but I can do this. I've left that for a long while. I'm going to assume what's behind D41 is safe. Well, <laughs> definitely. And I'm come over here. There's five. So I can actually see all five that are active right now. I'm just going to go ahead and end it. Um, I can't verify that D26 is safe. I can't verify uh that <sighs> crap I can't verify that 26, 38, or 15 are safe and I can account for all of the the rooms um, this is probably not the best decision but because you can't bank your scrap and you will see that there will be a ton of scrap because you can't bank it I'm not willing to take the chance I have pry I have uh, mine, so there's really not much I can do. Uh, like I said, I'm not willing to take the chance. And this, I feel really terrible about it. If I had stealth, I would do it in a heartbeat. If I had teleport, I would do it. I might take damage, but I could prepare a teleport to jump back. But I can't do it sick. And I've taken so many risks and everything on this ship except for some tiny rooms that probably do not have a lot of scrap. 15 actually might. Uh, it's a bigger room. But I'm going to go ahead and end it here. It's been almost 35 minutes. Wow. And I feel like I ran out of things to say a lot. But 1,130 points, 26 pieces of scrap, two drones, multiple upgrades, uh, no ship upgrades. I don't believe I missed any of those. There was one that was destroyed, and there was one that was firmly uh, sealed in place. So, wow. Um, people, Sunaru is still playing after 35 minutes. Uh, Going to be at the top of the leaderboard for a while, I hope. If you try it, good luck, and I hope you